As we are saying, Mure Zimbabwe, welcome to our channel, Zoom Confessions and Deep Secrets. Can I click the link to the channel? channel? Please don't forget to subscribe. Can I click the link to subscribe? But don't forget to comment and share this video. Nasi Mure Zimbabwe, Taki Girai, Nyaya Buditswa. Na, wa Nelson Chamisa, wa Nelson Chamisa, wa Buddha, wa Chitawara, wa Chiti Zimbabwe. He is now a family state, uh, Mure Zimbabwe. Uh, the former opposition leader Anusun Chamisa eh waka Buddha washitara wachiti the political arena eh under president Emerson Mnangagwa suru eh ya wese na mre Zimbabwe nzikanzi ruhu josera nika kumashure into and now a country ya tenwa into a one party detectorship mre Zimbabwe eh nofunga mamanzi apfura apu ya wa Anusun Chamisa waka buda mbato re citizens coalition for change wa chitawara wa chiti bato rabo angara infiltrate kwa ni sano pf mwere zimbabwe waka suwa konzeresa kutuwa wani kwe wa chi buda mbato ili na wa chamisa waka zuka wa chema chema wa chitawara wa chiti wa mnangagwa wa tena the government into the government the governing sano pf party into a family Afei, Mare Zimbabwe, Rabuda, Ashtawara, Machiti, anybody must support their own party. Changing political parties must be like having one government after the other. Just like in Ghana, just like in Botswana. Let us change political parties like we are changing diaper, diapers, not to have this thing where, it's, where it is like a taboo, a one-party state. We must have a multi-party state. In fact, we have ever, we have even gone further. We are worse off. It is no longer a one-party state. It is a one main state, one family state. That cannot be. We must not. We must not have that. We cannot be that. That's what Buddha Shtaro, Nara Nelson, Chamisa, Mare Zimbabwe, Mshere Mekunge country, Akabunige, Edwin Buddha. He celebrated the 44th uh, independence anniversary last Thursday. Wachami saw the Babudu was a car. Wachiti, my Zimbabweans, have sat again at independence on various fronts since the Negro Kuti Vajinji, my Zimbabweans, were entrapped in poverty. My Zimbabwe, Wakabuda, Australia, Wachiti, independence must be about our dignity. There is no independence when you are naked. There is no independence when you have nothing to your name. We must create wealth as a nation. We must regain our status amongst the, na the family of nations. Independence cannot be independence when millions of Zimbabweans are scattered everywhere, dotted, ar dotted around the capitals of the world, seeking employment, opportunities, greener pastures. Independence must have a new meaning. Buddha. Taurwa na wa Nelson Chamisa waka wajala lotari machiti Zimbabweans are suffering and any public address that does not speak to the suffering of Zimbabweans and acknowledge that citizens are suffering is deceitful, delusional and mendacious mwere Zimbabwe and ofunga kubira wa Chamisa wa Buddha mu citizens coalition for change Nakumira Moshe, the opposition party, Yurutuna Miru and Nagawosh Minube, it seems as if Yaparara, Mare Zimbabwe, so a Chinese of Abu Dach accuser, Ramanangagua and Guparara, Wakaita, the Citizens Coalition for Change, Mare Zimbabwe, Chinese, he wants to make sure Kutinika, you know, Sainita, a one party state, Mare Zimbabwe and Zakari, he wants to make sure Kuti. I ni wana wake wana ramba wana mpawa mwere Zimbabwe wana fuyama political observers haka Buda achita wala hii achiti the Zano PF wa mna umira mwishe wa mna ngagwa is trying to push for a third term tisindazie kutinia echo kwa dele kana kuti aswe wa mna ngagwa waka Buda wachiramba ma allegations iaya wachiti is going to abide by the constitution mwere Zimbabwe na umira mwishe wa mna ngagwa wa mna ngagwa waka appointa Nwanoawo David as the Deputy Finance Minister he waka appointa his nephew Tongai as the Tourism Deputy Minister for Tourism mwere Zimbabwe then 
eh, among other senior appointments eh, baka wani kwa chapu inda zokare ama zao mwere Zimbabwe kwa mnangagwa varu kwa zokare mwosa ni kwa abisa power ni kutendera eh, mkazu wawo the first lady maya auxilia mnangagwa pangwe chete ni wana wawo ya nsana nsira Emerson Jr. na Sean na Collins mnangagwa since they are embarking on international business engagement mwere Zimbabwe eh, since so uh, is creating a dynasty mwere Zimbabwe tinga zikuti mwere yuono say nya ii mwere Zimbabwe uh, ya budi tukwa na mwere yuono nchamisa kuti the president is now turning uh, the government into a family affair tinga zikuti mwere yuono say nya ii tuteo so mwere kufunga pa msoro pe nya ii mkomen section could is the president turning the shua eh, the government into a family affair kana kuti is appointing one who are qualified mwema positions avo to the oza mwuru kufunga pa msoro penye i mcomment section noti maka so votera party why do you support this party not that party anybody must support their own party and changing political parties must be like you know having one government and another just like in Ghana just in like Botswana it's happening elsewhere here on the continent Let's change political parties like we are changing diapers. You know? Not to have this thing where it's almost like taboo, a one-party state. We must have a multi-party state. In fact, we've even gone further. We are worse off. It's no longer a one-party state. It's a one-man state, a one-family state. That cannot be. We must not have that. We can't be that. Let's have proper money, decent salaries for our workers and even for our civil servants. Dignity and decency and honor for each and every citizen. Happiness for you, happiness for me, freedom for you, freedom for me, opportunity for you, opportunity for me. What makes the difference between a millionaire and a pauper is opportunity. We must be a nation of opportunities, a nation of millionaires. Of course, we can all be millionaires. But when you are even a worker in a nation that's rich, you're a millionaire. Millionaireship is not just measured by the money in your pocket. It's also measured by your dignity, your value, your worth and your wealth. Your value will be quit to future generations. Let's build a functional and well-maintained infrastructure system that works. These are the hallmarks of independence. Thank you very much. True independence is coming. And the hallmarks of a true independence are oneness, a togetherness, a united people, a united nation, a together society, a together generation. That's who we are. I wish you well. May God bless Zimbabwe. May God bless you, my fellow colleagues.